Well, I'm down here by the creek today, getting ready to do a little bit of magnet fishing. I'm at an old site. It used to be a grist mill. It dates back to the early 1800s. And at one time, this creek was dammed up. So this entire area here was covered in water. And I'm hoping when we throw the magnet around in there, we'll pull out some old stuff. Here's the rig I'm using. Seems to work pretty good. This is a 500 pound magnet. It's made by Brute Magnetics. It's very, very strong. I tell you what, if you throw this thing out in the river and if it gets hung up on a car, you're not getting it off. <laughs> I do recommend if you get one of these that you put thread locker around the bolt here. It'll keep it from coming undone and you won't lose your magnet. Here's what it looks like. And I'll put a link to the magnet in the video description if any of y'all would like to check them out. So, I guess we ought to get out there and see what we can find. We're ready to go. I'm just going to bob the magnet across the bottom and see if it gets hooked on anything. Nothing on it that time. I'll keep throwing it. Maybe out there some. Oh, that's a good spot. Pretty cool, ain't it? one time it's been all the way across the creek take a look at this rock I just came across it has a big hole in it not sure if that was man-made or if it's natural kind of weird there may be one more right there. That's pretty cool. It's definitely man-made. Perfect location too, right beside this creek. I mean, there could have been a Native American village right here 2,000 years ago. You just never know. That's another one right there. Two of them. About eight feet apart. Unbelievable. That thing looks a hundred feet deep, don't it? That would have been the perfect place to build camp right there. Right on the rock. 
overlooking the creek. Come down here and get you some fish. I've gotten just a little bit distracted from magnet fishing, but that's okay. There's a lot of stuff to explore at this place. Looks like there might be a cave over here. It's a good place for one anyway. Hey, check that out. I'm about a hundred yards upstream now, and I just found another one. That is crazy. It's exactly what it is, though. You can see where it was carved out. I'm about to go over here and throw my magnet in the water. It gets really deep. Off in there. It's probably about four or five feet in the middle. So it's a good area. Let's see if we can get across without getting soaked. Ooh, down in that bedrock crack would be an awesome place to search. No telling what's in there. There's another one right there. Look at that! Crazy! Wow. Let's see if we can find any more. River's very shallow today. Scraping the bottom. So 
this is pretty crazy. I just came across this rope. Somebody tied it to the limb. And it goes out into the water there. Let's see what's hooked on the end of it. Over here under this bridge. Let's pull this thing in. Must be stuck or something. If it wasn't, they wouldn't have left it out there. over here on this rock or between these two rocks probably not going to be able to see it this is unbelievable I just got it out I'm going to have to pull myself back over there you got to check out what it is it's very funny that I found this let me get it out well, must be stuck on something again. It's stuck in between some rocks. Yeah, I can't get it out. Don't want to hold on. Guess what it is? It's a magnet! That is unbelievable. Somebody was out here magnet fishing in the river right below this bridge and they got their magnet caught in between some rocks <laughs> and I just happened to find it hadn't been there long look how clean the rope is right there has a little bit of algae on it from being in the water hey that's a good find right there I told y'all I was going to go magnet fishing today <laughs> I'm up here on the bank now figured I'd leave this magnet where it was Cause you know they're going to come down here looking for it. They had it tied on the tree there. And hopefully, when they come back down here, they'll find it. So, let's leave that there. And get back to magnet fishing. Just eyeballed something down here in the water. And it looks like a cell phone. Finally got that phone out the water. I don't think it has hardly any steel in it or iron. But I was able to get it on the edge like that and slowly pull it out the water. It's a galaxy. Been there a while too. No micro SD card in there. Usually there is. Well, that's pretty cool. I'll keep on looking around this area. Water is super clear. You can see the bottom. About seven feet deep right there. You can see how I'm bobbing the magnet along the bottom there. This is the best way to do it. it. Keeps the magnet from getting hung up in between all the rocks. When you're pulling it in from the bank, it's very easy to get it wedged between some rocks. magnet just stuck on something pretty big. Let's see if we can pull it up. Oh, it's heavy. May have to use two hands for this one. Hang tight. Whoa! Check that out. Man, that is crazy. I just pulled that up with this magnet. I bet it weighs 30 pounds or more. 
but it feels a lot heavier when you're pulling it in the water, especially from a kayak about eight feet above. Well, I guess I'm going to have to get the magnet off of this. It's going to be tough. It's a very strong magnet. I'm going to have to get my screwdriver out or something to pry with. We'll pry this thing off. That was not easy to get off. That's good though. It means this magnet is doing its job. That's what we want. <laughs> Had to get all nasty muddy too. It's crazy. Had to use my rock pick and I pried it in between the magnet and the flat piece of steel and barely got it off of there. You gotta think. I had to use 500 pounds of force to get it to move. So good. Let's get back out there, find some more. I'm going to bring that piece of metal home with me. Look at all the deer tracks. Wow. A lot of them out here. Have my very first pocket knife. Found with the magnet. Oldie Goldie. I'll take it. Let's see what else we can find. Check out that tree stump underwater right there. All kinds of trash laying around here. I hope there's trash in there. There's a bag. Wonder what's in there. If anything, it may just be sand. Hmm. And check this out. I wonder if something's buried here. Probably a dog. There's the collar. Very weird. Just out here along the river. Terrible people have to come in here and dump their trash like that. It ruins it for the rest of us. Well, I'm gonna get back to it. Have something pretty big down here. I think it may be a sign. It's got some weight to it. Yep. Looks like a road sign. Got 
There you have it. I am cleaning up the river today. <laughs> oh. See if I can get this magnet off. Oh. Got it off. Got a little bit of dirt on there. Not a whole lot though. Clean it off. I'm good to go. <laughs>